Super Fun Stuff. Welcome to another video for Super Fun Stuff. Today marks a big occasion. All of the tomb bolts are complete. This all started in September 2017 when I created my first tomb bullet from the iconic movie Who Framed Roger Rabbit. At that time, I just watched the movie again and I was really starting into 3D printing. It just started almost as a novelty idea, make a cartoon bullet from a movie that I love. I used tools like Tinkercad to make my models, I used my miniature paints to paint them up, and created something that I loved as much as the movie. What surprises me is that no one wanted to make these characters before. I understand they're a small part of the movie and don't really have any roles in other stuff, but they're so unique and lovable. Well, after making the first Toon Bullet, that signed me up to make the bunch of them. After on and off work on these guys and the Toon Gun and learning a ton of stuff in the process, it has finally come to a conclusion. The last Toon Bullet is here. This is Shifty Eyes. Shifty Eyes is the last amigo with a sombrero, double bandoliers, and a shady look. He is only in one scene in the movie, seen sitting in the gun box with the other Toon Bullets. From all the Toon Bullets, he was the most complicated and most detailed one to make. Originally, he was going to be the first Toon Bullet that I made. After fooling around with modeling him, I decided to put him on the back burner because I couldn't get him right. It was just too difficult for me at the time and I wasn't happy with the results. But after some time, some more experience and learning, I'm finally there. So here is Shifty Eyes, the last Toon Bullet, to join the Toon Bullet team. Shifty Eyes is available for free on my 3D modeling store. Also, thank you to my patrons and other supporters on my minifactory.com. You guys are the best. So as we hit this milestone, what's next? Well, I'm not done with Who Framed Roger Rabbit stuff quite yet. I have the two molts, I have the tuned gun, but what about the box it came in? That will be one of my next adventures. Also, stay tuned for other cool stuff I make, including miniature stuff and nostalgic toy stuff. 